Hey everyone, so today we're gonna be showing you how to get uh, the Chunk in a Go mod uh, in Minecraft. So, you're gonna wanna open up uh, the Minecraft launcher and you're gonna. So, for this video, we're gonna be. I use 1.17. I use the latest release currently. I have used the uh, 1.17, but right now I'm currently using 1.17.1. But, but in this video, we're gonna use. 1.16 to play Minecraft. So this is before Caves and Cliffs. So if you want to get 1.16, go to create a new installation and switch this from to 1.16.5 and click create and click on this play button and it will start uh, loading. So while well, loads, I'm going to pause. Okay, so now that your 1.16.5 has loaded, you'll see a Mojang Studios thing, and it's going to load this, and it'll take you to this page where it says this. So you're going to want to click quick game because that it just wants to make sure you're using uh, Minecraft. 1.16.5 and you're going to want to go to fabricmc.net so it'll take you to the page that looks like this and you're going to want to go to where it's a, where the installation page is and you're going to want to click on here and right now I'm using Windows but if you use Mac OS or Linux click this button so I'm going to click this button so as soon as it loads, you're going to want to uh, open it. And it'll take you, it'll, a window, a little window will pop up. And it's going to show you, it's going to make you a new profile in the launcher, in the Minecraft launcher. So, right, and you're going to want to switch this to 1.16.5. And you're going to want to switch this to 0.11.0. .0. And you're gonna check out. You're gonna want to check create profile. It should already be checked. And then click install. And it should show a little window. Click OK and close. And close this page. Okay. So now you're gonna want to go to search up fabric .ap, fabric API. And it'll show this little CurseForge page. So basically, it's gonna show something about the 1.17. You're going to want to scroll down to where it says 1.6, Minecraft 1.16. Um, you're going to want to click on the green R because the blue, the the B and A is supposed to be a beta, alpha and beta uh, versions of Minecraft. You're going to want to get the R one. So, download that and it, the, download should, the, proce the download process should start. And it's a jar fertile, so folder, so press keep and now you're this is the mod you'll need chunk in a globe so go to this curse forge page and as you can see the current game version is 1.16.5 so click on this button or if you want you could just scroll down to where it says if you use minecraft 1.15 go here it'll give you 1.15 1.15.2 download but if you but for this tutorial go to one point minecraft 1.16 download this file And then the download process will start coming again So it's a jar file press keep and then you're gonna want to do this you're gonna want to uh, bring these files To the home screen so you can get them in the folder and then you're gonna want to press close on your browser so now you're going to want to go to the search bar and type this percent app data percent so press open and then you'll see this dot minecraft folder click on it and then you should see a mods folder if you don't have a mods folder right click and then uh, click on this new button and then click folder and then make the folder name mods so uh, you're gonna wanna. So as you can see, I already have a folder, the exclusive. Ex I already have the jar folders. 
but I want to, I am doing a tutorial, so I we'll want to move these two to the recycle bin. So get, put, get these two into the folder, and then close your folders page, and then, and then go to the launcher. So, yes, now we're in the launcher again. So, as you can see, you will have a fabric loader profile. So, you click on that and click play. And another loading process will come up. So, you just have to wait for it to load. Okay, so, I just did the tutorial. So, now let's test out... Now let's show, I'll show you what the Chunk in the Globe mod does. Just in case you want to know what it does. So, when the, this window opens, uh, yes, let's have a look at this. The window just opened, the window just appeared. So let's have a look at this. Let me pause. Okay, so now we're in the main menu screen. So you're going to click, you're going to, so it says what Minecraft 1.16.5 slash fabric modded and you're gonna want to play a single player game or if you want yeah so create a new world and uh name it whatever you want i'm just gonna name it chunk in a globe because yes and i'm gonna go to creative mode to sh to so i get like uh yeah i'm just gonna go to creative mode and uh Yes, if th this might pop up sometimes, but just click proceed. And we're, let's have a look at this. To prove that the, yeah, just to show what Chuck and the Globe mod actually does. Okay, now we have the mod itself. So let's go to page two. And here's all the globes. Here's all the Chuck and the Globes. So let's get this one for example and let's place it here and then when you right click it will take you to a very small world as you can see so yeah that's what chunk of the globe does and if this helped you then leave a like and also subscribe thank you so much for watching